Alright guys, so lately, me and my buddy Dan have been playing this Kerbal X space program. And one of the first things I did was modify the game so that I could use a lot less fuel. And then he suggested that we have basically a challenge to see who could get the furthest in the stock game. Basically, who could build, you know, the best ship. And, uh, I just thought I'd show you guys what I ended up with. Uh, Dan suggested that I make this video just because this thing is, like, so big. I don't think anyone else has attempted to build anything quite this big in this game. As you can see, it takes a minute for the game to load this thing. And as you will see, it takes forever to launch as well. So, yeah, it makes things interesting. So, what we have here is an incredibly massive launcher with a total of 256 solid rocket boosters. That's why I've called 256. And I called it stupid just because Look at it, it's just stupid. <laughs> so, so how it works here is we have 128 rockets on the first stage, then it goes to 64 rockets on the second stage, and then we have two stages of 32 rockets. So a total of 256. <laughs> and as you can see, there are 16 stages of separations and ignitions and so on and so forth. It took me hours to set up all this and actually have it work correctly. So I'm going to show you a launch. I'm I'm gonna time lapse the launch for you guys because as you will see it's gonna be ridiculously slow. So you trust me you're gonna want to watch this in time lapse. And uh, so I'll just hit launch here and you guys can see what this thing does and I'll give you a round view to show you just how big this thing really is. It basically extends from the floor to the ceiling. And I don't think you could actually build anything bigger than this because for one, the game crashes like Every other time I load the ship, it, it could crash right now, for all I know. Um, and as you'll see, if you did go any bigger, y it would take you half an hour just to get off Earth. <laughs> as you will see. Okay, so we did a successful load, surprisingly. And it's doing four frames. <laughs> using 20% of my video cards and as you can see it is so wide it actually hangs off the uh, it actually hangs off the launch pad uh, I'll do a quick fast forward for you guys so I can see now that's funny I'm not even looking at the ship and it's still broken. It's, it's, it's broken. <laughs> oh my god, what happened? I think my ship blew up. <laughs> yes, my ship blew up. <laughs> it's doing zero frames. Okay, I guess it's going to be a nighttime launch, guys. Good to me. There we go. Turn on the SAS, even though that has issues controlling this thing. 
I usually have to fly this in manual controls. Now here's the problem. Running 128 rockets, you end up with a result of 1.2 1 frames. <laughs> wow. <laughs>
And that's my crazy ship, guys. Now I'm doing 50 frames <laughs> from one.